The use of emojis in OBS should not be understated. I want you to look at something. Look at this menu right here. Just take a glance, a quick glance at this menu in the corner and tell me what you think I use most often. What do you think is the most important scene for me to click over here? Um, chances are you're probably going to go for the thing with the most green on it here and that would be correct. For anybody that guessed that, um, it was pretty easy for you to guess. And if it's that easy for you to guess um, what I use most often, how much better could you customize your stream and your use of OBS with emojis? Take another look at the scene collection menu here. You can see there's a few items, pretty much the top two thirds of this list doesn't really have any emojis, but near the bottom, there's way more emojis here. And I think you can guess here um, what scene collection that I use the most as well. Same thing with the profile tab, whole bunch of nothing and and then boom, tons of emojis all over the place. Emojis can be used very easily and very quickly to help clean up menus in OBS for you to be able to quickly take a glance at things and understand what it is exactly that you are trying to use. So I would encourage you to get creative with emojis and to customize them in a way that you would personally understand what is important to you. And if you have a lot of scene collections or a lot of profiles or scenes, if you have a lot of options that you use frequently and interchangeably, then use different combinations of emojis that are, again, personable to you. The easiest way you can use emojis is I just typed in copy emojis on my internet uh, browser and uh, I would recommend going to the get emoji website. It's this one with the purple icon get I guess you could do that as well. This website is a, uh, a pretty accurate copier if you can call it that it it some places uh, will let you copy emojis um, but it's not going to look really the same from the website uh, as it is after you've copied and pasted it into whatever it is you're pasting it to so with getemoji.com it seems to be very accurate um, from copying here and pasting in obs Another thing you might want to consider is changing different fonts. So you may not have noticed the different font that I have down here for some Elgato scene collections. Different fonts can be just as helpful, maybe slightly less helpful than emojis, but still helpful nonetheless. Um, in order to, again, continue trying to organize your menus in OBS. And if you want to consider using different fonts, what I did is I just typed an online font changer. I clicked the first one and you can type whatever you want here. And then you can just scroll on the right side and it'll customize um, your font into different uh, styles. Some things might not work exactly as they're shown, um, but we'll see if we can rename, add some stuff here. No, it didn't, didn't quite work out there. So some things that don't work 100% of the time. Emojis, on the other hand, um, it's a lot easier to, um, to have things copied and and pasted um by and large you can use emojis to uh to really help clean up things and uh, stay organized in obs um so just a little tip uh food for thought